What's up world, Matt here, and today we're practicing the English for how to talk about people's possessions and things that belong to people. Last weekend, I went to the park, and it was a busy day. I saw lots of my friends. I saw Gabriel, who was at the park practicing football with his team. I saw Camila, who was at the park doing an aerobics class and exercising. I saw my friend Beatriz, who was at the park having a work meeting with some potential clients for her business. And I saw my friend Carlos, who was at the park answering phone calls and taking his dog for a walk. After a while, it started to rain really, really heavy. And all of a sudden, everyone went running to leave the park. I noticed that my friends had left a lot of things and so I grabbed everything that I could. But now I have all of these shoes, bags, and drinks in my car, and I don't know who it belongs to. I was wondering if you had any ideas about whose stuff is this? Do you have any idea about which objects on the left might belong to which of my friends on the right? I'd love to hear some of your ideas and guesses as to which of these objects belong to which of these of my friends. Why don't you pause the video, share as many ideas as you can, and then we'll keep practicing. Nice, great work practicing talking about who these objects might belong to. I'm gonna keep your ideas in mind see what we can come up with practicing, and maybe at the end of the lesson, I'll take these objects back to my friend. Now, I wanna introduce you to some people who are really important to me, my family. I'm going to introduce you to each member of my family, and they'll do a small gesture with their hands. I want you to try and remember the names of my family members and what gesture they do, so that we can play some games. First, Here's me. My name is Matt. My name is Matt, and my gesture is... Now, here's my brother Andy. My name's Andy. Andy's gesture is... Now here's my brother Jack. My name is Jack. Jack's gesture is... Now here's my mom, Julie. My name is Julie. Julie's gesture is... Now here's my dad, Limo. Hi, my name is Limo, and this is how I greet my friends. Limo's gesture is... Let's repeat them all together. Matt's gesture is... Andy's gesture is... Jack's gesture is, Julie's gesture is, and Limo's gesture is. All right, now I'm gonna practice asking you some questions and I want you to answer trying to remember the names and gestures of my family members. Is this my mom Julie's gesture? Yeah, this is my mom Julie's gesture. My name is Julie. Is this my brother Andy's gesture? No, this is my brother Jack's gesture. My name is Jack. Is this my dad Limo's gesture? Yeah, that's my dad Limo's gesture. Hi, my name is Limo and this... Is this my brother Andy's gesture? Yeah, that is my brother Andy's gesture. My name's Andy. And is this my gesture? Yeah, that is my gesture. All right, now let's try and do it even faster. Is this my dad Limo's gesture? No. That's my mom Julie's gesture. Is this my brother Andy's gesture? Yeah, that is my brother Andy's gesture. 
Is this my brother Jack's gesture? No, this is not my brother Jack's gesture. Is this my brother Jack's gesture? Yeah, that is my brother Jack's gesture. Is this my gesture? No. Is this my dad's gesture? Yeah, this is my dad Limo's gesture. And is this my gesture? Yeah, that's my gesture. Nice work practicing those. Now I want to ask you an even harder question and see if you can answer speaking even more English. Now I'm going to do a gesture and ask you whose gesture it is. I want you to think which member of my family and try to say a full sentence explaining whose it is. For example, if I say, whose gesture is this? Then you'll think and say, hmm, ah, this is your dad's gesture. Yeah, that's my dad's gesture. All right, let's try some more. Whose gesture is this? Yeah, that's my brother Andy's gesture. Whose gesture is this? Yeah, that's my mom Julie's gesture. Whose gesture is this? Yeah, that's my gesture. Whose gesture is this? Yeah, that's my brother Jack's gesture. And whose gesture is this? Yeah, that's my dad Limo's gesture. You've done an awesome job practicing talking about the gestures that belong to my family members. Now I'd love your help to figure out whose stuff is this? So let's start out with this yellow football cleat. Whose shoe is this? Yeah, I think it's Gabrielle's shoe. Gabrielle was at the park practicing football. I think this shoe is Gabrielle's. Whose shoe is this? Yeah, it's definitely a woman's shoe. I think maybe it's Camila's shoe or maybe it's Beatrice's shoe. Whose shoe is this? This is also a women's shoe. So maybe it's Camila's shoe or maybe it's Beatrice's shoe. Whose bag is this? Hmm. Well, I agree. I think it's a woman's bag. So maybe it's Camila's or maybe it's Beatrice's. Beatrice is at the park for a work meeting with some potential clients for her business. I don't think this bag is very business. It seems more vacation, day off. I think this bag is Camila's. Whose bag is this? Yeah, I agree. I think this is Beatrice's bag. It looks like a professional business bag that Beatrice would bring to her meeting. Whose bag is this? I agree with you. Maybe this bag is Gabrielle's or maybe this bag is Carlos's. Both Gabrielle and Carlos are at the park doing something active practicing football, and going on a walk with their dog. Maybe this bag is Gabrielle's, and maybe it belongs to Carlos. Whose drink is this? Yeah, I agree with you. There's two possible options. Maybe this drink is Gabrielle's. He was at football practice. And maybe this drink is Camila's. She was at an aerobics class. Whose drink is this? I agree with you. Maybe this drink was Beatrice's. 
She was at a work meeting and that might help her wake up for her early morning work. Or maybe this drink was Carlos's. Maybe he was relaxing in the park, sitting with his dog. All right, one more. Whose drink is this? You're right, that drink could belong to anyone. It could be Gabriel's water, Camila's water, Beatrice's water, or Carlos's water. Well, thank you for your help helping me figure out whose stuff is this. I'm gonna go get in my car and take my things back to my friends, and I hope you keep practicing English, and I see you again in the future. Take care, bye.